Hey beauty, today we're going to be talking Amazon summer accessories. I've got everything from sunglasses to jewelry to handbags, shoes, and even hair accessories. So get comfy and let's go ahead and get started. I've been randomly getting a lot of questions about my jewelry in my style videos. I do mostly wear Amazon jewelry. I've actually shared a dedicated Amazon jewelry video a while back and I do have a jewelry list on my Amazon storefront if you're ever curious about some of the jewelry that I'm wearing. But I did sort of need a refresh, especially on necklace so I went ahead and bought two mega packs. The first one, I'm actually wearing two of the necklaces from right now. I really loved it because it had this green little necklace and it had this just basic clear rhinestone necklace and I loved those. It did also have a cross, which I thought was super cute. These are all individual. It does include one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different necklaces. Four of them are paperclip style chains. There's a large, a medium, a small, and an extra small one. This one is a really unique chain style. This one is just your basic flat chain. And then this one is a rope chain. I do also love a flat snake chain style. This charm is removable as is this like round oval one, but the ones that have the rhinestones are not removable from their necklaces. I love that I can mix and match these. I did go ahead and grab a, another like super mega pack, which has a whole bunch of necklace styles. I did go through and try and find a mega pack that had the best reviews. Cause you know, when you're buying 30 necklaces at once, they're not gonna be the greatest quality, but I do like to mix and match my necklaces a lot. So for me, the more the merrier. How cute is that little pearl necklace with the pink butterfly? And these are individual and the butterfly one is a rhinestone style. It did have three other dainty pearl styles. This one has a sun and a star, super cute. And then this one has a little rhinestone butterfly. Some of these are individuals and some of them are necklace sets, which I do appreciate having a necklace set where it's like three layered necklaces and one clasp. I did also really love that they included this style of chain because I don't have one like this. I wanted options and options is what I got. I try not to shower or work out or sleep in any of my necklaces because that's what is going to tarnish them and I do rotate them a lot and mix and match them a lot so that I do get longevity. But if you're wanting just like basic ones that you can wear every single day and they're of higher quality, I will leave those in my jewelry playlist. So go check it out. I did end up getting two pairs of earrings, which this one I think is my favorite just because it is a little bit different, but I feel like it looks so expensive with the matte gold mix with the shiny gold. I love the shape of it. This is just giving me like summer resort vibes. I would say that they have a nice luxurious weight to them. They're not super heavy. I definitely have earrings that are heavier, but you know, they are a weighted earring. So I did have to add my earring stickers to them because listen, I'm Latina. I've had my ears pierced since I was two months old probably, and naturally my piercing has just stretched out over the years, but this definitely gives me a little bit extra hold and makes them more comfortable throughout the day. And I love that it comes in a hard case. I did also go ahead and grab these super thick gold hoops. I absolutely love this style. My mom has a pair that are real gold that are very similar. Every time she wears them, I'm like, those are cute. I like how wide these are. 
while also being like a medium size hoop. I definitely feel like they make a statement while also still being a basic. Moving in to sunglasses, one of my favorite accessories ever. I did end up getting two new pairs because I didn't have any mirrored sunglasses. I do already have these in the gold and black and I was gonna get the black on black, but then I saw the mirrored blue ones and I just couldn't help myself. They are so fun. I love them. They just put a smile on my face. I probably still will go back for the black ones, but I did also end up getting these pink cat eye ones, which I love with your swimsuit on and a nice little cold drink in your hand by the pool. So cute. I love the matte gold on these with the pink. I do also want to mention two pairs of sunglasses that I wear all the time. This oversized black plastic frame is one of my go-to. I love the gold B, but it does also come in a black B if you're wanting just a black on black oversized pair of sunglasses. I did also notice that they had three packs of light pink, cream and tan colorways of these. <laughs> these are my go-to when I have no makeup on, which is almost every day, unless I'm filming. I love these so much because it's giving brow. It's also kind of making my face come in right here since the angle comes in. It's very flattering. They look very expensive in my opinion. Should I do handbags or shoes? Let's go with handbags first because I came across this one and I don't think I've seen anyone talk about this yet. I loved the bamboo detail. It's still giving those summery vibes without it being like a woven handbag. You're still getting the leather and the gold. It did also come with a crossbody strap, which I always appreciate. There is what the inside looks like. It does have a card holder pocket. It's also more of a cream color. I ended up with two of these woven handbags. Saw this one and I couldn't not buy it. It's in my favorite color and it's just so cute and unique and different. It's so funny. I literally had a pair of pink shorts right here. How cute would that be with like a white tank top, some flat sandals or wedges, which I do have both to share with you. It did also come in a neon green with with the white woven and I thought that was so cute. I also love the light bamboo handles on this. It came with tassels, how cute. The inside is just open like that. The inside does have one of these tie style so you can close it up if you need to and it does have a big card pocket right here on the side. Love, love, love this one. I'm not sure why I hadn't purchased this one already, but I love how basic it is. I'll be using this every single year. You can totally grab some little twillies and tie it around the handles if you want, or just on the side if you want to add some color. It did come with the crossbody strap. It looks like this one doesn't have any pockets or anything on the inside, but it's such a great classic staple summer bag. I'll never get tired of this one, which speaking of one that I'll never never get tired of. I've had this for maybe three summers now. It does have snap details right here where you can open it up if you need to, but I don't really like the metal showing, so I typically keep it like this. It does have a zip close feature. It does have a pocket detail right in here. It's pretty roomy. It's such a great vacation bag. Time for another one of my favorite accessories, which is shoes. I was actually wanting a pair of flat gold studded sandals because I have silver studded ones which I will talk about but I am a gold girly which I just noticed that I never switched back to my square earrings but now that I have the correct earrings on we can continue talking about these but like I said I'm a gold girly and I was really wanting a pair of gold studded shoes that I could wear day to day. I came across these clear ones which I have worn they are very 
very comfortable. The listing does have some other really cute styles like the rhinestone ones you always see on Pinterest. These were only $10. Here's the thing, if I see a pair of flat cute sandals for under $20, I'm gonna buy them and I came across these strappy nude flats. I figured that these could be a good summer staple as well. They do have some support on the bottom so I'm not just like walking on the flat floor and there is a slight cushion on them as well. Here are the Notorious studded sandals. I still feel like these are super cute. I don't know, maybe that's the millennial in me holding on to these, but it's just such a fun jewelry moment on your shoes that just makes your outfit look so cute. I love the studs around the sole and of course the studs on the straps. If I press down, you can see my fingers to where they are actually memory foam cushions and these are by the brand cushion air you can tell that i've used these a lot probably should have wiped them down and cleaned them but they have held up really well let's talk about these amazon essentials leather strap flip-flops i love how thin the leather strap is they are a memory foam sole and i want to say these are only like 13 dollars i prefer a leather strap over just like a nude plastic because these just look so much more elevated i did also grab these clear strap wedges which i think are so cute a great update to a basic wedge i love that these have the gold sole clearly i'm obsessed with gold but they did have an option that has a silver sole. I did actually wear these to my brother's graduation and they were very comfortable. The sole does have some cushion to it. I'm obsessed with these. You'll definitely be seeing these in more Amazon style videos. I had to mention these little wedges. These are very comfortable to walk in. I've had them for several years now. They are very similar to a pair of Steve Madden's. I do love the stitching around the sole here. Another thing that I love about these wedges in particular is that you can wear them like this with the two strap, or if you wanna put them in sport mode like your Crocs, <laughs> you just twist the strap like that and you can wear it around your ankle. This strap right here is very stretchy. They both are, but this one is not and it is a faux suede. You can't go wrong with a basic nude wedge. Let's move into hats. I do have two classics from Amazon. This one came in a two pack with the tan one like this and then it had a black ribbon as well can't seem to find it it's probably in a suitcase in my attic but i wanted to talk about it because i really love these it does have the velcro so you can adjust it and then it has the ribbon where you can tie a cute little bow i do love that it's a visor because i can wear a high pony with it a lot of times when I'm laying out or just watching the kids play in the pool, I don't want my hair on my neck because it's so hot here. I love this so much. I did look and see that this one in particular is not available anymore because I bought it so long ago, but I did just want to mention a floppy hat because you can never go wrong with this. It's a classic. You'll get a lot of wear out of it. You'll probably have it for years. They have lots of super cute ones. I did even see some that were sort of like a crochet that I thought were really cute. They have the ones that say hello sunshine and all of that. This adidas camo one is super cute you can wear it so many different ways and i love the camo print with the white adidas i do also get a lot of questions about my leopard print hat it is so fun i love this one so much i'm really not a hat girl so i do appreciate 
like a hat moment when I do wear a hat. Oh, oh my gosh, I almost forgot the hair accessories real quick because I have gold metal hair clips, which I got a six pack of. The other three are scattered around my house somewhere, but I do really enjoy these because I feel like they have a more solid grip on my hair and they are super cute. Of course, I got them in gold. But I did also wanna mention this oversized claw clip. I got this to wear when I have my extensions in and I just wanna clip up my hair. My cousin actually told me about this one at Target, but I was on Amazon and I saw like a four pack of these super oversized ones. Get them at Amazon and not at Target because you get more bang for your buck on Amazon. It's like double the size. I wanted to mention this scoonchie, our biggest scrunchie ever. It's the original scrunchie jumbo size. And again, I thought that this would be good for when I have my extensions in. When I have my extensions in, nothing is big enough. Extra wide scrunchie right here if you're needing, you know, something to hold your hair back. Hit that subscribe button down below so we can hang out more and you don't miss my future content. Like I said, I have a sheet and haul to film. Stay tuned for an Amazon beauty video coming soon. Thank y'all so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.